Okay, so we got a call this morning. We were cleared by public health for 30 minutes. For whatever reason, they knew 30 minutes was going to be the time, so we got about 20 minutes. We need to do laundry, we need to do shopping. What else do we got to do? Um, laundry, shopping, that should be it. Uh, yeah, that should be it, but those are the two most important things right now. Right. Because we got dirty clothes and not a lot of food. And the food we do have are MREs. <laughs> so we need to hurry up, follow me. Oh, and take out the trash. Oh, yes. I mean, this has been sitting here for like, it seems like three days. But I it's only been, a day. yeah. <laughs> it feels like forever. Ready? Mm-hmm. Hold your breath. This never happens. <laughs> this never happens. So this is where you do your laundry. It's a communal uh, spot, so you have to share with everyone. <laughs> this is the first time they've ever all been open. And I'm just trying to work fast. I don't want to take a break. Two so, should be good. All right, guys, so with our 30 minutes, we were told we had, it was actually a bit more than that. We think the guy on the phone was just trying to be funny, but uh, we were told basically we are unquarantined because now with the updated times, we do not fall into uh, the times they gave us. So now we're technically good to go. We've been pre-screened. So with that being said, we were given this opportunity to go and buy some snacks, some food, because you know there could always be another positive case. And what's funny is we were told we're not quarantined anymore but we were told to stay at our home, our residence, where we're at. So we're gonna stay in my room. Public health cleared both of us to stay together. And on top of that, they said basically that they're gonna rotate us into a working schedule potentially. More or less just told to stay put, limit movement, and only go out if necessary. Uh, we went out and we grabbed a bunch of snacks and stuff that we can. So here's what we ended up getting. We got these blue corn tortilla chips, which I turned around to these. Don't lie, I put oh, you on no, these. Oh, you did, you did. These, these are good. And her favorite, I feel like I've had this before we met, but the roasted garlic chunky salsa, which is good. Uh, I got some more shampoo because I was running out. I got this strawberry cheesecake, or I'm sorry, strawberry shortcake ice cream. I don't expect you guys to see any of this stuff, but this is just some of the stuff that we got. Peanut butter cup, Ben and Jerry's. We got a bunch of rice. She got her favorite monster. This is the mango juice one. Picked up some bananas from the dining facility, which I'll get to in a minute. And also these things. I don't know if you guys can see this, but this artisan style white chicken salad sandwich. All the shopettes will have this deli style kind of grab and go. So the one that was her favorite, she turned me on to is this white chicken salad sandwich. So we got two of those. And then these things she also turned me on to. This Red Baron deep dish pizza. They say deep dish, I, they're minis. I don't know how deep dish you can consider these. <laughs> But we got two of those. And then we got some milk because I have instant coffee. I like to put milk in my coffee, so I use a lot of milk. And the amount of milk we were using was way more than the people who could drop it off for it. And then we were told the dining facilities were open. They finally let us go in there and take to go, even though we're in civilian clothes. So I grabbed an apple cinnamon uh, instant oatmeal, a whole grain strawberry pop tart. Trust me, I did not pick whole grain on purpose. They have only whole grain pop tarts there. And at the dining facility today, let me show you what they had. So here's what I got. We got spare ribs, cauliflower, and the orzo rice with tomato and gravy. So we're gonna sit here, grab some lunch. I'm gonna make some more instant coffee. And we're just gonna hang out for a little bit until we're given further instruction. Probably watch a movie uh, and just find something to chew up our time. Oh, play some more Super Nintendo. She did say that. Oh, we've been hooked on the Super Mario World. It's funny how something from way back when is now this year's entertainment. Okay, so this is the part of the day where we're going to do a temperature for ourselves because since, well, we were quarantined, now we're technically free to go, but they de definitely did say it's a self-monitor. So our leadership also came down and gave us this COVID-19 screening questionnaire to fill out. And it's basically just asking general questions like your name, your unit, your phone number so you can be contacted, and then all the questions where the people who were tested positive, like all the places they visited and the time. So you just go through the survey here and you basically check the dates and times that you may or may not have been there. And so before I fill this out, we're gonna check our temperature and see where we're sitting at. 97.4. Okay. Oh, you can't see it. 
So she got 97.4. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do my temperature now. Why am I so cold? This is 96.1 for me. So basically the premise of this is that we don't have a high fever, so we're good to go. We're doing our part here as far as self-diagnosing or self- uh, Self-monitoring. Self-monitoring, there you go. Here we have some churro donuts. These are exceptionally delicious. They are the perfect blend of cinnamon sugar, donut, it's doughy, it's chewy, and they are excellent. And Jenna, how do they smell? They smell like cinnamon and sugar. <laughs> it definitely tastes, and or I'm sorry, it smells like a churro for sure. Mm-hmm. So today we woke up, <laughs> you did some work, we went for a three mile run. Oh, we played Super Nintendo today too. We did. Uh, I finally beat a level. Normally he beats all the levels. Also today, since we are technically not quarantined, but more or less practicing social distancing. So I say that, but <laughs> we're obviously not being that distant right now because we are quarantined together. So they're like, you know, you guys are a married couple. You guys can go ahead and do your thing. So here we are. We can leave for mission essential items. That means that we can technically work if they need us to. So I actually got called in, did a couple things. So I was at the office for a couple hours. Oh. Well, I made spaghetti while he was doing that. I was gonna say. I, oh, sorry. While she's making spaghetti in the meantime. So overall, today has been very uh, like uneventful, but also very eventful at the same time. So really, today we woke up, we started playing Super Nintendo. I think we had some breakfast. We had another one of those breakfast mm -hmm. burritos with the egg bake. Pretty much after that's when we went to the shop. Yeah, and then you cooked, and then I worked for a little bit. Well, I went to the commissary first. That too. Then I came back and cooked. Which, mm -hmm. fun fact, while all this is going on, there's no taxi service on base at the moment now. Right. So I was originally i just gonna walk to the commissary anyways because it's not that far from his dorm. <laughs> And it's somewhat nicer out now. Mm -hmm. But the walk from the commissary to where we were, a bit of a walk. <laughs> but now, since she uh, did some more grocery shopping for us, we got a bunch of stuff here. So we're basically just gonna eat here. She's gonna study. I'm gonna work on some videos, maybe play some more Call of Duty in the meantime, and just kind of. Uh, Super Nintendo! <laughs> and Super Nintendo, of After course. I yeah. study. And uh, really, that's where we're just gonna have a really chill night. We were talking about watching a movie. We're also gonna do another workout. Our three mile run we did today was mm -hmm. just part one of the workout. Right, so yeah, we're gonna do that and we will see you guys in the afternoon. Bye. So here we are, we've made it day three. A lot of big things happened today. Uh, we were told that we were free from quarantine. Uh, so the places that we were at previously that they said were hotspots were cleared. And I tell someone, hey, here's where I was uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I went to the shop at the commissary and the BX from 10 to 11, 11 to 12, 12 to 1300. And they take those times and that's what they push out. Pretty much your leadership had to ask you, have you been in these places during these times? And you had to answer yes or no. And that's why we got quarantined because I had went to three different spots and he had only went to one. So because that happened, we were quarantined, right? And then for some reason, again, they were changed or they were taken off the list. They were no longer hotspots. So now we're all good. But we were told because there's this potential, there's this possibility. Uh, we basically are just on like a- Quote unquote standby. <laughs> yeah, without using the word standby, we're mm -hmm. basically on standby. So here we are just kind of hanging out, waiting for further instruction. Obviously you want to take a lot of precautions when doing this. I'm sure there's a lot of stuff that the upper leadership are doing and taking care of that we don't know of but um, you know it's better to be safe than sorry in these type of scenarios I think that's what they're doing with with us is that we're cleared to go but we're not really mission essential right now so we're just kind of in limbo just waiting for the next course of instruction but with 
being off of quarantine, we had a little bit of freedom today. So we went to the post office, we went to the BX, we went to the shopette, we grabbed a bunch of food items so we didn't have to eat MREs. We, we did got, laundry. Yes, we, got, we were finally <laughs> able to do laundry after a couple days. So uh, that's the big update for today. We'll see what day four brings us. And in any case, we're going to head out because we're both very tired. Uh, we did sand bottles today, mm -hmm. or sand art, sand art and bottles. We did that. Uh, we played, I played a bunch of video games. I downloaded Call of Duty War, Warzone. I've been hooked on it now. Uh, I'm very sorry, but you're okay. exceptionally patient. I'm so fortunate. I'm so lucky. I what studied else did we a do? lot. Yeah, I studied a lot for staff. Uh, I edited a bunch of videos. She edited some videos. Oh, I posted a video today. Yes. All of our descriptions going to be in the comment down below, but my camera's running out of battery, so I'm just going to wrap this up now. Thank you guys for your time and attention. I greatly appreciate it. And we will see you in the next video. Till next time. Thank you.